Muldura settlers have taken a commanding position after day one of their match against Kumiala Wentworth in round nine of Sunraysia cricket. Choosing to bat first at the McLeod Oval, sets compiled four for 262 before declaring their innings closed after 67 overs. Luke Stanbrook led the scoring with 94, Paddy Keogh made 71, and Jason Morrison and John Pratt contributed 30s before the home side stumbled to 3 for 13 at Stumps, Luke Coates claiming 2 for 7, and the Blues facing a torrid time this week. At Irimple, the home team managed a tally of 191 after being sent in by Muldura East, Jez Graham and Dan Coughlin scoring 30s, and Jaden Hunt the pick of the visitors' bowlers with 3 for 72. East will resume at none for 16, still with a fair bit of work ahead on day 2. Muldura West faltered after a solid start with the bat against Workers' Goal Goal, managing just 138 all out, having been 3 for 99. Opener Ben Hallam anchored the innings with 63, Will Parsons next best with 21, while seamer Jake Albrecht bagged sixth for 70 from a 25 over stint. In reply, workers got the wobbles losing 3 for 3 before finishing on 4 for 32, but with some good batting including Wade Hancock still to come, there should be plenty of zest at Karamar Drive on day 2. Nichols Point has the upper hand, chasing Merbein South's 128 at Chafee Park. The visitors finishing day one at 2 for 59, with Brad Thomas unbeaten on 36. Tony Trinick's 34 was the only contribution of substance for the Saints, while Aaron Sayers and Rocky Wotai both claimed three wickets for the Pointers.